हेलो वेलकम टू द डायनेमिक्स मॉडलिंग ऑफ सिटीज चैनल दिस इज अपेक्षा पाटीदार एंड टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू लर्न अबाउट फोटोग्रामेट्री फोटोग्रामेट्री इज द साइंस एंड टेक्नोलॉजी ऑफ ऑप्टेनिंग इन्फॉर्मेशन अबाउट फिजिकल ऑब्जेक्ट थ्रू प्रोसेस ऑफ इंटरप्रेटिंग फोटोग्राफिक इमेजेस और जस्ट इन सिंपल लैंग्वेज जनरेटिंग थ्री डी यूजिंग नंबर ऑफ इमेजेस देर आर सेवरल फ्री सॉफ्टवेयर अवेलेबल ऑन इंटरनेट ऑफ फोटोग्राफिक्री टू स्टार विथ we need to capture the image of an object from all the possible angles and make sure that you have covered all the areas a very important information is that uh, some softwares do not recognize images of an reflective area it it does not take into account or any shiny water transparent dark or reflective surface so keep that in mind Today we are going to explore photogrammetry using two softwares. First is Cool Map, and second is Mesh Lab. So what Cool Map does is it collects all the images and then make a mesh of an object from these images. To start with, we'll go on Reconstruction, and then Automatic Reconstruction. Here a tab will be open. Uh, select the folder here. what you need to do is uh, you need to make a reconstruction folder and this folder of photos is the folder where you have collected all the uh, images on, of an object so select reconstruction here and for the image folder select the photos folder which you have which has all the photos and just check for here that the quality is medium as we are going to do it for a trial because it takes a lot and lot of time so just for the starting go to the medium and then click on run just wait for it because it is going to take some time mesh we created now we what we need to do is to export this file into a 3d format of plyy and we'll just give it a name so going towards our next software which is a mesh lab mesh lab will convert our mesh into an object which we have created in um our cool map so let's get started with importing the mesh from the cool map uh, as you can see the one st- uh, structure file i have saved in the 3d object apply format is here we are going to open that and you can see here number of dots or points i would say which have imported with our main object mesh so what we need to do is to delete the extra points and details from this mesh so we will start by clicking on this tab here which will is select vertices we are going to select the vertices and then hold control which will add the points and it will delete all the extra points we have and we can delete it by here clicking on this make sure that you don't have any extra points because that will also be used in creating a mesh and will kind of distort our object so deleting all the extra points from every possible way and here is our final object result as you can see and uh, you can also zoom in zoom out using the mouse wheel and orbit around using the left click on the mouse and can pan around using the wheel by clicking on the wheel holding on the wheel and now to start with we we'll want to have a um, recognize points so for which we are going to go on normal curvatures and orientation after that we will go on compute normals for point sets and uh, 
without changing any value we will just go to apply because changing the value will change the mesh and uh, will give some other result so we don't need that and we just going to apply this and just close as you can see somewhat points are being recognized and now what we need to do is we need to have a surface on this mesh for which we are going to select the meshing simplification reconstruction and then go on surface reconstruction screen points and without changing any value here we can just click on apply and see the desired result just wait for some time and as you can see this is what it has given us so this is what our desired, desired, desired result is you can also change the value here and can apply more the value more time it will, it will take to create a mesh here is our desired result and this is what we generated you can close this window from this and yeah it's pretty same looks like what we have we can uh, do is just click on the this vertices will which will uh, make the other vertices close and yeah here is our object so it is as simple as that and uh, here is our desired result so thank you for watching